All right, hey guys, Jay-Z here, Sweet Whiskers. It's really dark, you can't see me, sorry. Um, but I am about to go off on a, a preliminary search. I am meeting with an owner who has reported a cat lost to Sweet Whiskers, and I thought I would just take you along for the journey. It is so dark outside. Why? It's like not even six. Anyhow, all right. Um, so I've got my backpack, my gear here. I've also always got a kennel with me at all times. But in my backpack, I kind of have uh, some essentials. I've got my water bottle. I've got a uh, a flashlight. I also have a flashlight with a um, a zapper uh, for defense because um, I have run into uh, dogs on the loose before during cat searches, which can be a little unnerving. Um, I don't ever zap them with it, but it, the sound scares them. And so it's enough to protect me. Um, but I've got my air muzzles. I've got um, some um, kitty treats, different food sources, lots of stinky tuna, uh, and a laser pointer, which is pretty high powered laser. It's not your traditional one. It's a, it's a pretty high powered one. That's mostly for pointing out to owners where I'm looking, kind of teaching them as I go how to look for themselves. Not necessarily to play with a cat, although sometimes it does work. <laughs> um, but most cats are scared and hiding. So um, I've got my gear. I'm going to go and uh, head out and meet this owner. Okay. We are on a hunt for another cat. Case number 269 is Bones. He's been missing for a few weeks. However, I did just run into a deer up here. Thought I'd take you guys along for the journey real quick. Oh, yeah, they are. Look, oh, look at those antlers. Do you guys see that? He's gorgeous. Check out the trees. Oh, hi, sweet boy. Don't worry, I'll keep my distance. Oh, and there's another doe behind him. Anyhow, um... We're going to keep looking. Guys, unfortunately, we did not find the kitty tonight. Um, so we're going to uh, mount a larger, more organized um, search. And we did totally lay down in a bunch of sticker burrs. So I am covered head to toe. i got to go pick those off. Um, unfortunately, didn't find the cat. But we've got some strategies. This is going to be a cat that I think will be best for... Um, live trapping really and so we're i'm gonna go ahead and mount a search whoa light there sorry um we're gonna mount a search for an organized search for volunteers to come out and help with so i'm gonna go get these sticker burrs off me and warm up because it's getting chilly Woo. um bummer we didn't find them i always love uh, finding them on that first go this was really more just oh their spotlight just went off uh really more just um here, let me get in the car so that I can actually see you guys. Okay, it's really more just um, information gathering, understanding the cat's temperament, looking around the main area, see what they're, where they've actually been spotted. Wow, their spotlight just turned back on. Must be motion activated. <laughs> uh, I'm a nutcase at night. Sorry, guys. All right, I will keep our search and rescue volunteers posted and. Uh, yeah, hopefully we find this kitty. This is closer to Arbor Street here in Ames. So if you guys want to help with this search, definitely um, let me know and or drop it in the comments and I'll make sure that you guys have the link to uh, sign up for the volunteer.